want to address a, a problem that a lot of you are having in, in making your bags. And the problem is you're having problems with your carrying yarns showing through like this. Uh, one thing I want to clarify is your proper stitch formation. Okay. Now you're going into your back loop. Now, if you watched my videos, I suggest that you go all the way in put your your hook all the way into the loop as to open it up pull your carrying threads forward and make your stitch again go into the back loop all the way through pull your carrying threads forward you can hold them in place with your thumb because that gives you some tension okay now when you run into this problem now i went a little bit further than i should have on this but what a lot of you are probably doing is you're going in you're making your stitch but you're not holding these carrying threads in in the front or in the back some people like to do it in the in the back and that's fine too i just find that holding it in the front I know where everything is and um, but see see how you not holding it in front or back you're getting spaces whereas if you hold it in the front like this it's already putting tension on your carrying threads and then the stitch is tighter now one of the ways to solve this problem or one thing that you're supposed to do anyhow is you need to pull your carrying threads and you're supposed to do it like every eight to ten stitches uh, or when you change colors and the way you do that is I'm going to go all the way back into this area I'm not sure that it's going to work but you want to hold your uh, your middle finger and your thumb back before where you've pulled your carrying threads before so you hold back and then you need to pull each thread at at a time one at a time you want to hold hold real tight here because you don't want to be pulling from back here or you're going to start cinching up your your work but i'm not sure that this is going to work real well because i did go so far but you want to pull on each one and this was just a, something that I had started and didn't finish. And it doesn't seem like it's pulling a whole lot here. Okay, I got a lot out of the green. And then what you need to do is if you still have space in there, you, you hold all of your threads, all of your carrying threads. And then you, I put my, my thumb and my middle finger in front of my last stitch and you pull them a little bit as to, it's kind of hard for you to see i know but i pull it as to pull all these stitches together and then you even them out you don't want to do it too much because then you're going to mess up your um the flatness of your bag this is not flat this is this is this was something I did a while ago and um, so I'm just using this as an example but as you can see it closed up all those gaps that were in there okay so that's what you need to do if you're not doing it that's probably what your problem is and I hope that helps you if you have any questions you can always shoot me a a message on our Facebook group and I'd be happy to help you out. Okay. Have a great day.